Hi everybody and welcome back to IC Arts and Crafts. Today we are making an abstract cart. I'm making it for my grandmother since her birthday is coming up. And, and don't forget, hit the like button if you enjoy this video. These are things you will need. A hot glue gun, an iron, many colors of paint, wax paper, shredded crayons, regular paper, but uh, I have two kinds, so I'm using two kinds. If you have two kinds, you can use two. A paintbrush and a black marker. Okay. And a picture frame and scissors. Let's begin. I actually forgot to say that you need shredded crayons of different colors, but it's okay if you only have one color. The first thing we are going to do is take our paper and make the background. You're going to take your shredded crayons and sprinkle them on the paper. And spread it out. You don't have a lot you don't have to put as much as I'm doing I just have a lot of it so I'm using more next you are going to take your wax paper and put it on top and then you iron it. If you're not allowed to use an iron, you can ask an adult to do it. And iron it down to make the back. Then you'll have your back. Next, we will be making the heart. I'm going to be using my different kind of paper, but if you don't have a different kind, you can use the same one as you did for the background. I don't have a very big square, so I will be doing a skinny heart. And open it up. And there's your heart. Now I'm gonna take my frame and see if my heart fits in the square. And if it doesn't fit, I can adjust it. It fits perfectly. Now I will be making my abstract heart. I'm gonna be using all of the colors except black. Pour them into a circle in the middle. There. I was able to fit all of them in. Now let's start painting our heart. Now you have to let it dry. I'll be back in an hour or two. Now that my heart is dry, I'm going to cut out the rectangle that will be its background. 
I need to make sure it fit inside the frame. I'm gonna be doing it right here. And take my picture frame and see if it fits. It does fit. And turn it around. Now I'm going to to glue the heart to the background before I open up the picture frame. And look how it turned out. I think it turned out very good. Don't forget to like the video if you enjoyed it and subscribe. Bye.